What's up, Nerds and Geeks? My name is OMG, WTF, LOL, FTW, BRB, and welcome to episode 56 of Let's Play Smackdown. Shut your mouth. I'll be honest with you, in the previous episode, I believe we just sided with Vince McMahon and Ric Flair, but it's been quite a long time since I've actually sat down and played this game, so let's just, uh, let's just get started, shall we? Let's jump right in. Because the, the last thing I remember was uh, Vince McMahon and Flair joining forces and uh, the uh, undisputed champion, yours truly, DDP, siding with him. What did we do last week? Oh yeah, we were in that match. So tonight on Monday Night Raw, we have a TLC triple threat match between Hardcore Holly, Brian Pagillo, and Eddie Guerrero. I might not play that match just because I don't know if I want to do a triple threat match. Then of course, yours truly in the second match against the Big Red Monster, Kane. Boy, do we have history with him. And in our main event, we have a Table Tornado six-man tag between Undertaker, Billy, and Chuck, taking on Rikishi and the Hardy Boys. But a little bit of history with the Big Red Monster, Kane, and I'll go to further detail about that in a, a few moments here. I'm pretty positive we may have ourselves a cutscene on our way. I called it. All right, what do we got here? All right, come on, Jer. There we go. As you already know, we have 100% sole ownership of the WWE. But I don't think you understand what else that entails. In other words, all championship belts are ours. But I'm a generous man. I will give even losers a chance. You can have a title shot against DDP, the champion. His ego is out of control. I can't believe he's forcing them to have a title match. He's the owner. They have no choice. What does that mean? Does that mean I have to defend my title? Oh, um, all right. Uh, now our match is between Stone Cold Steve Austin. Um, wasn't expecting this. What did I do? I I thought me and Vince were on the uh the same page here. I mean, <laughs> Diamond Dallas Page, you get it? No, but all jokes aside, hey, look who's this? Oh, it's William Regal. Will I am Regal? How are you doing today, uh, Regal? God, these loading screens. But I I thought me and Vince were cool. You know, like we were on the same side here. Why is he forcing me to put my? Hi, how are you doing? Is there anything I can do for you? I just want to say hi. If you didn't need anything from me, why bother? Uh, I am the undisputed champion, William. I'm not like you. I'm very busy. I'm the undisputed champion. I'm always busy. What? Hey, what? You, you believe this guy? How dare he? How dare he? Seriously, though, like, how dare he talk to me like I'm the undisputed champ. Speaking of it, I gotta go talk to the boss. Uh, I gotta clear some things with him right now because I'm not sure who's the one getting punished here. I feel like it's me. I'm pretty positive him and I are on the same side, and he's over here making me defend my title against uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Hey, DDP, what can I do for you? Glad you came by. I wanted to talk to you, too. How am I doing right now? Your current superstar points are 99. You are an icon to WWE. Actually, you're an icon of all sports entertainment. Well, that's all. I mean, I'm an icon, so it makes sense that I would go up against icons. It's not a punishment. Actually, it's a privilege. It's a privilege for me to... I'm glad I had that talk with uh, with uh, Vince McMahon here, because it's a privilege for me to even go up against his biggest rival of all time. He trusts me enough to take down his biggest rival, and we're going to do that. Uh, let's see. Eddie Guerrero wins... Um, I don't think I want to play, so we're gonna we're gonna skip and have. That's right, Hulk Hogan was gonna win. I was gonna play as him anyway. Undisputed Championship match. Let's do this. I'm gonna finally put an end to the Texas Rattlesnake. Finally put an end to him. Vince McMahon has trusted me. He has entrusted me, nerds and geek. Oh my, entrusted me to uh finally. End the Texas Rattlesnake, and that's what we're going to do tonight. 
That's right. Well, uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin definitely been the thorn in Vince McMahon's uh, plans so many times. I mean, who could forget the infamous, it was me, Austin, it was me all along. I mean, Vince will do anything, and I mean anything, to get rid of Stone Cold Steve Austin. Except fire him, apparently, because that's just out of the question. He wants to torment him or something, I don't know. He wants Austin to quit. Anyway, though. He will do anything, and that is why he sent me in, the WWE's icon, the undisputed champion, the best champion this company has ever seen, the real people's champion, and not only the people's champion, the wrestling's champion. We are the hand-picked champion of Vince McMahon and Ric Flair. We are what truly is best for business. And tonight... He sent me in. He sent his big guns in. He could have sent in some other low-life person that's part of the new alliance here. He could have sent in someone else that's part of the owner's team. But no, he sent in the big gun because he knew there's only one person he can rely on. And that's me. It's DDP. Alright, so uh, um, it's been a while since I've played. So bear with me, nerds and geeks. I'm going to... I'm going to try to remember how to do everything. I've been playing 2K13, or 14, excuse me. I keep saying 13 by accident. Okay, that was Taunt. I'm trying to learn how to, I think it's Triangle, it is. And Square was Reverse. Oh, oh, okay. All right, Austin, you're not letting me learn my moves real quick. How many episodes has there been where there's literally me just talking about um, what the controls were because it's been forever since I played the game? The suplex, baby. Yeah. I don't mean to brag, nerds and geeks, but uh, Stone Cold does not have a chance. No, he's not. Get up, Austin. I'm gonna... Oh, God. Yep. How long has it been since I played? Forever, and I'm still better than you. That doesn't count, though. Austin, stop. Stop, Austin. Austin, please stop. It's just a slight setback, I swear. I'm gonna revert. Next move, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna reverse this move, watch. Told you! Always have faith in your loved, undisputed champion, nerds and geeks. The one and the only Diamond Dallas Page. Even the losers get an opportunity in the reign of Vince McMahon and Ric Flair. Even the losers. And me, Diamond Dallas Page, their beloved United S United States. Ha! Undisp oh god. Oh god. You, 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 you can't flip off the you the undisputed cha Hepner, get in the ring. Can't flip off the undisputed champion. Yeah. How do you like that? Ow! He kicked me in my face. As I was saying, though, even Austin, you're not making this easy. You're not making this easy. I was just going to let you have a freebie and, you know, just let you take a diamond cutter and lose. But I don't even think you deserve one. But bang! Diamond cutter. How do I pin again? That's how I pin. Is there anyone that can stop me, nerds and geeks? I mean, I'm just so damn good. <laughs> Fuck Stone Cold Steve Austin. Yo, oh, that champ! Told you, Vince McMahon trusted me. He sent me in there to finally put an end to Stone Cold Steve Austin. No more Texas Rattlesnake. He said, Diamond Dallas Page, I want you to go over there and I want you to step on the head of the snake. And I said, you're right. I will do that. And that's what I did here tonight. Stone Cold Steve Austin is no more. No more. Who are they going to send at me next? The Rock? Hulk Hogan? Pff, whatever. What do we got? Let's do this. Let's do this. 
Rock's gonna come out there and be all like, I'm the true people's champion. And I was like, uh, no you're not. Well, tonight on Friday Night Smackdown, we have a six-man battle royale in the opening match. Edge versus Mark Henry, Brian Pagillo, Rico, and Spike Dudley. No one wants to say that name. And the next match, it's a tag team match. Yours truly will be teaming up with Booker T to take on Billy Gunn and Kurt Angle. Losers. And in our main event, The Undertaker takes on Hulk Hogan. Why are they in the main event? I should be in the main event. Just saying. Undertaker and Hulk Hogan. They nearly cannot touch the name Diamond Dallas Page. Never in a million years would Hulk Hogan or The Undertaker ever be mentioned as a great wrestler above DDP. It's just not possible. Who else is around here? Is that Rob Van Dam? What up, man? What does is, what is the Van Daminator have to talk about here today? What are you doing down there, Taylor? Can't see my cat, but she's uh, she's being a little... Oh, hey, dude. Do you have a match tonight? You should stretch before your match so that you don't get injured. And stretch carefully. Do you want to do it together? Who do you think you are? Who am I? Me? I... He actually talked. You don't like me? Well, I don't like you either. You won't. We can settle this in the ring. Don't forget the stretch. First, he's going to tell me, the undisputed champion, what to do. He's going to tell me to stretch before... I'm the champ. I don't... I don't need to stretch before matches. I already know what I'm doing. Second, you're going to... This guy... The ego... Well, would you look at that, nerds and geeks? Some random person won the Battle Royal. Oh, boy. I don't know what that guy's name was, but that was pretty crazy. Certainly in the WWE, we don't recognize anything like that. Especially under the command of Vince McMahon. Your undisputed champion cannot do that. Anyways, back to Rob Van Dam. What an egotistical bastard. Yo, How dare... It's me. It's D. Hold on. Hold on. We can't talk during this entrance. I'm just going to stop talking. I can't stop talking, nerds and geeks. This guy coming down the ring right now. I don't think you understand. He's the best. He's an icon. And tonight, Booker T should be just happy he's teaming with me, to be completely honest. How come Diamond Dallas Page is in the Hall of Fame? I want to know that right now. How did people like Coco Beware and Booker T become a WWE Hall of Famer for Diamond Dallas Page? Hey, how did Hulk Hogan do it? Or Bret Hart? Or Stone Cold? Or The Rock? Or Bruno San Martino? No name is bigger than Diamond Dallas. Well, there is one. and uh, <laughs> I think he's the future, but we'll come to that one in a little later. But still, Diamond Dallas Page, the man. You know what, Booker T? That is the stupidest looking face I've ever seen. I'm talking crap about my partner right now. He looks so surprised, like, I don't know where I am. But, uh, I'm gonna go down to that ring. I'm gonna whoop some ass. If he's still making that, he is. He looks like a fucking fish out of water. <laughs> oh my god, Booker. <gasps> it's like he can't breathe or something. What is THQ doing? No wonder they're out of business. Look so good to me. Oh, the Intercontinental Champion is going to step in the ring with the Undisputed Champion? Billy. Billy, what are you thinking? Me and you used to be allies, too. I just want to say that. But if this is what you're going to do, fine. I'm going to sick my fish on you. Piranha. Book a tea, bite a motherfucker. I don't care. Just don't show him any worms. Watch what I'm about to do, Nerdsy, because it's about to happen. You suck! <laughs> you suck, Kurt! You suck! <laughs> you suck! Because he sucks, you get it? You suck! You suck, and you're not even good. You suck! I'll, I'll let the fans take over. You're going to do it for me. You suck, Kurt. You and your bald head. You look like, you look like Caillou. 
You remember Caillou? Each day I play some more. I don't know the words to the song, but his name is Caillou. 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 Ah! Ah! Hey! You better knock it off! I don't get my hands dirty. I'm sorry. Take the... Take the how, how the hell do I tag people in? Stop! Stop doing that, dude! What? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Alright. Ah, Billy! I'm trying... I don't... You are not worthy of being in the ring with me. There we go. You take care of it, Booker. You better not lose it either. Does he still look like a fish in the ring? I can't see. Come on, Booker. God, you're so bad. Oh, that was pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. It's pretty neat. Yeah, there you go, Booker. Booker T. Yeah, take both men down with them long ass legs of yours. Walking like the creeper from Scooby Doo. Oh! The Skittles of Booker T right now. Hey, hey, hey. Come on, Book. Get back in this. There you go. There you go. Mother... Get your... Bald-ass Caillou self back over here. Why did he walk so weird? I tell you, someone at THQ did not like Booker T. They make him look like a fish when he comes down to the ring. And he walks like he's the creeper from Scooby-Doo. Would you do something, Booker T? God, you're so bad. A fish out of the water. Ah! Ooh! No DDP stop! I gotta do everything for Ah, don't you touch me, I'm the undisputed champion! Oh come on, ref! Biasm! Book, give me the tag! Tag me, Booker T. Booker. Yeah. Don't you touch me. Damn it, mother. Booker, give me the tag. Thank you. Oh, the scoop hagen dot. Referees can't do that. It's a conspiracy. I'll win us this match. Don't worry. Ah! He ain't got nothing against me. Get out of here. Rep, you better get your boy out of here. I'll stay here for a little while. I think I got it. <sighs> Look at you standing on the outside of the ring like you did something, Booker T. I carried this team. You did nothing. I won that match. Not Booker T. Dumbass fish. Oh, we're about to beat him up even more because we're such badasses. The attack continues after the match. Did DDP sell his soul? No. He's just doing what he's told by the owners.
Hulk Hogan made The Undertaker tap out, really? You expect me to believe? Whatever. I highly doubt Hulk Hogan made The Undertaker tap out, but whatever. We'll go with it. Anyway, nerds and geeks, this is the end of episode 56 of Let's Play Smackdown. Shut your mouth. If you have enjoyed this episode, do me a favor. Leave me a comment, a like, and please subscribe if you have not already. And as always, my name has been OMG WTF LOL FTW BRB. Please don't forget to share this video with your friends, Facebook, and Twitter to help this channel grow a little bit more and gain some more subscriber base. And as always, you nerds and geeks have yourselves a wonderful day.